Hello, my amazing subscribers and welcome newcomers. I am Carnage, the creator, and welcome back to Survival Adventures in the wonderful world of Carnage. Yay, we are back again in the world of Carnage, and oh my goodness, is it getting dark. Oh gosh, this is bad. This is really bad. We need to run. We need to run as fast as we can, and we need to get out of here. Uh, more specifically, we should probably go to bed, but you know, we're not doing that. We're getting out of here. Isn't that right, and we're going outside because most people would run for the bed. We're running towards adventure. So let's go ahead and run towards our advent. What, what are you, Chief? What are you, Chief? Do you want to go on an adventure too? You know what, Chief? You can come on an adventure as well. I have no clue where we're going. We're gonna we need to go somewhere. Bandit, try to keep up. We're on our way. We're on our way to Adventureland. I don't know what I'm saying. It's not called Adventureland. It's called the World of Carnage. We're gonna go to the World of Carnage and adventure. And uh, Bandit, you better be keeping up, bro. Oh, there. He's a super speed runner, so we're gonna run all the way over here. Okay, actually, I kind of have an idea what we need to do because we are very, very low on spruce wood. So I'm thinking what we should do is we should get ourselves a bunch of spruce so that we can put it over there on top of the roof. That is most definitely what we need to do. So uh, I'm thinking we kind of got ourselves in a little predicament. We got too many animals and not enough places to put them. So we're gonna we're gonna hop off here. We gotta make a place to put our animals. So we're gonna grab ourselves a lead, but. Wait a second, no! We don't have a fence post! We used it inside of the barn. What were we thinking? Alright, we've got it. We gotta take a alright, we gotta take a break from this adventure and we gotta go back. We gotta go back on over here. We gotta put Chief up and we'll continue our adventure shortly after. So let's go ahead and go right back over here. But at least Chief had a chance to stretch his legs, man. He was like really getting tired of eating the same old hay right there. He had to stretch his legs a little bit. Oh no, Chief, you're eating the wrong you're, why'd you eat that grass, man? That's the pig's grass, man. Alright, so let's go ahead and Hook him up right here in his favorite spot in the entire world of Carnage, right there in front of the house. Maybe he'll have a different favorite spot eventually, but that's his favorite for now. All right, Bandits, come on, buddy. We are going to go chop some trees, but we're not even we're not even going to wait for it to turn daytime. We're going to do the unthinkable. We're going to stay up through the night chopping trees. We're going to be the best nighttime tree choppers of all. Oh goodness, what have we got ourselves into? There's a there's a skeleton there. I think we may have, we may have messed up, man. We may have, we may have made a bad decision. Let's go ahead and shoot the Skeletor, get out of here, Skeleton. No one invited you to the world of Carnage. You know what? Let's just chop at least a few of these trees down. We're not going to chop down a ton of them. We will go back. We'll be smart, right? This is called survival adventures. One of those keywords being survive, right, Bandit? We got we to survive. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to sit you down right here, buddy, and we're going to chop down some trees, and then we'll go back to our house so that we can survive through the night. So we're going to go ahead and go right on over here. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, you random wolf, you dude, you killed a skeleton all by yourself. I'm so proud of you. So we're gonna go ahead and chop down this tree right here. We're gonna get every last bit of this spruce on out the way. Get out of here, spruce. We need we need we need as much of this as we can. You know what? Let's actually go ahead, put our leads up here and grab our spruce down here so we can keep an eye on how much spruce we're getting. Because we need a lot of this stuff. We need as much of it as we can get so that we can work on the roof of the barn. The barn's not gonna build itself, so we gotta we gotta make sure that we're doing that. So we're gonna Whoa. Whoa, are you? No, you're not Bandit. You're that random wolf again. Wolf, what are you doing, man? I'm not, I'm not food. Don't you start sniffing on me, man. I'll, I'll, I'll mess you up. I got a sword and junk. So we're gonna go ahead and go right on over here. We'll chop up some more trees. We're trying to get to where there's like clusters of trees so that we can remove some of them. We don't want to remove um, too many of these trees because we do want it to still look like a forest. So we're gonna make sure that we only chop down trees in the cluster. Oh my gosh. Ooh, get out of here. Come here. Get out of here. Ooh. Well, oh, oh my gosh. Oh, there we go. <laughs> totally planned all that. I don't know what you're talking about. We're gonna go ahead and eat ourselves the steak. We blew a hole in the world. <laughs> Hashtag hole in the world. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, chop down these trees right here. We're gonna pretend none of this even happened. We're gonna chop down this tree right here, and <laughs> and we're going to get all of this spruce, all of all of it, including you up there. What are you doing up there, spruce? Come down here. Get down here where you belong. There we go. We got it. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, well, let's see. Do we have any dirt? Yeah, we do. We got 20 dirt. That should. That should kind of sort of work, but not really. We're going to at least fill in some of this. We're going to go ahead and fill it in right here. This is not going to be enough at all. The creeper blew up most of it. He took it with him to his grave, but we can at least fill in that much. Well, that'll be the, the memorial of the creeper right here where this hole is. At least until we fill it up. Oh, wait a second. Hold up. Boop. There we go. Haha. <laughs> all right. So let's uh, chop down a few more. Let's not chop these down. These are too close. We could chop down this one, though. This is a great big tree. We could get it out to it. Hold up. We got to look around for creepers. Make sure there's no creepers creeping. So we're going to chop down every last bit of this spruce. Spruce, you got you to gotta get down from there, man. All right. So we got to go up to the top. 
up to the tizzity top and we're gonna go up like so and then we're gonna chop and we're gonna well really just what one, one log that's it i went all the way up there for one log are you kidding me let me get down from here all right so let's chop down i would say one more tree and we'll be golden yeah let's go with one more we'll chop this one down right here it's in the middle of a cluster so we'll go ahead and we'll take it from its tree family and we'll we'll bring it to a new home all right we're gonna Oh, there we go. All right, so there we go. We've got all of this done. I forgot where I left Bandit. Bandit, where did I leave you, buddy? I know you're in the middle of these woods somewhere. Hold up. We got to run around. We got to run around. Oh, hold up. I, thought I saw a sapling. Oh, yeah, sapling. All right, so we must find our dog, Bandit. Oh, we didn't finish chopping this tree down, did we? <laughs> Let's take a little side break. There we go. All right, so off we go to find our dog, Bandit. Bandit, I know you're around here somewhere, buddy. You're somewhere right on aha i see you over there you're you're in the light you're smart bandit you stayed over there right by the torches so then no creepers would come after you the creepers came anyway creepers what are you doing get out of oh don't you blow up on me don't you blow up on me creeper don't you blow up on me get out of here boom fool all right so let's go ahead and go on back to the house we're gonna take a snooze after that great adventure. We just went through the night. We've taken out creepers, and some creepers took us out too. But we're going to, uh, we're gonna go to sleep really quick, and we'll get back to work over here on the barn. The barn's got so much work that needs doing, but luckily for us, we are uh, slowly but surely getting this thing done. It's not going nowhere. I'm telling you. Well, I mean, technically, it's going nowhere. But we're we're getting we're getting somewhere, aren't we, Bandit? We're getting a lot of this stuff built. Um, each episode. So let's go ahead and go right on inside. I don't know why I left my doors open. Bandit, why didn't you tell me my doors were... Oh, my goodness. Oh, is that a... Is that a skeleton? Oh, that's Bandit's favorite skeleton. You done derped up. Bandit's gonna eat your face off. You done, you done mess with the wrong crew. All right, let's go ahead and take you out. Yeah, there you go. Good job, Bandit. High five. Well, hold up. I, I don't want to... I'm not gonna... You don't have thumbs, man. Come on. You only have four. You can only do a high four. All right, so come on, Bandit. We're gonna go ahead and go right on over here. Actually, do you eat... I don't even know. Do dogs have five fingers? I don't even know if that's... The... Come on over here, Bandit. Get your butt in here. We're gonna close these doors, and we're gonna sit you down. Are you gonna hang out right there? I think uh, because you've been such a good dog today, we're gonna also give you your favorite street in the entire world, some rotten zombie flash. I'll give you two pieces, because you are very hungry dog so we're gonna go ahead and run right on over here and we're gonna take a snooze just for a little bit just a, a nice little nap we stayed up for most of the night so we at least got a at least got a lot of adventuring out of our system so let's go do some surviving and one of the most key things to survival is making sure you got all the different types of animals so you can get all kinds of different stuff. For example, the cows over here, they provide us with leather. The pigs give us pork chops. The chicken gives us, well, chicken. And not only that, but they also give us eggs and leather. So they, they give us a lot of stuff. And what what do we need for all of these? Of course we need our barn, but our barns are not quite ready yet. Oh, there's an enderman! Because we gotta finish building the roof. Enderman, did you just go in my barn? Enderman, you better not be in my barn. You better, oh, you, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. How many arrows do I got? I have seven arrows. You know what, Enderman? I will waste one on you. I will. Oh, wait. Actually, no. Enderman cannot get shot with arrows, can they? But I know what can get shot with arrows is creepers. And I saw a creeper up there. I bet he ran away. I bet that creeper ran away. I would run away if I was a creeper. So we're going to go ahead and go right on up here. We're going to take a look. I think the creeper must have jumped down or something. We're going to go up here. We're going to make a quick little glance. A quick little glance to make sure that Mr. Creeper is gone. Yes, Mr. Creeper is gone. I'm so proud of you, Creeper, for doing the right thing and being smart and not getting messed up by Team Carnage. So we're going to go ahead, grab ourselves some wooden slabs, and we're going to run them all the way across over here. We're going to get this entire roof done in this episode. Yeah! Actually, I don't know if we have enough spruce for that. We're going to get as much done as we can, though. We're going to at least get a good little bit of this done. So we're going to go all the way, all the way across. I'm going to make sure that I go far enough. I need to... Go at least like two more, I think. So we're gonna go one and two. That might not be enough. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, that looks like enough, right? I think that's enough. I don't know for certain. But we're gonna go ahead and place these across right here. We are gonna need some more slabs, it looks like. So we're gonna place these all the way across like so. We are gonna run out of slabs. But that's okay, right? I mean, we're gonna we're gonna easily be able to make some more. We don't need much more. But first, let's go. Oh, wait a second. Hold up. Wait a second. Look at that. We had more, but we didn't quite have enough still. All right, so let's make all of the uh, all of the planks that we possibly can. Whoa, this is going to make a lot of planks. Look at how many planks we got. This is a crazy... We got over three stacks of planks. I did not realize how many we were, we were getting right there. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, place these all the way across. We're going to place these as much as we can. Also, we do have a crafting... You know what? Before we even deal with that, let's finish up these slabs. Let's actually let's actually finish up the uh, the side before we use all of these planks. Let's use some of them to uh, make ourselves some slabs. Let's go and click on into here. 
We're gonna go right on over to the edge. We're gonna scroll on down and we're gonna make ourselves the wooden slabs of doom. Really, we only need a little bit of them. We got six of them. That should be more than enough, if I'm not mistaken. So we're gonna go right over here. Oh my goodness, we fell. I was gonna say we're gonna go right on over here, but we died. We died. Fell off the side. So we're gonna go right on up here. Be very, very careful not to fall. And then we're going to. Creeper, that's where you went. I knew you were still around here somewhere. You know, we're gonna we're gonna do a, a super long. Oh, is that wolf? Nope, that wolf decided. All right, here we go. We're gonna take the super long. Why, Creeper, why'd you stop, man? I was anticipating where you were gonna be. Hold up. Boom! Yeah! Hold up, can we get it one more time? One more time. We're gonna run out of arrows. Oh. Yeah! <laughs> the longest creeper shot of all time. Who saw that? That was amazing. I am so proud of me. All right, so we're gonna grab ourselves some awesomely cool slabs. We're gonna place them down. We did we we only needed one are you kidding me that's literally it we could have found a slab somewhere else all right we're gonna no you can't really find them anywhere but we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and uh place these right here place them all the way across we do definitely have to uh make sure we light up the inside of this uh inside of this roof because it is gonna start getting dark right under here but there's nothing for them to spawn on we just got to make sure that all the surfaces are lit up that's really all we're gonna do but we're gonna go ahead and go to this side right here we're going to place these all the way across, all the way to the end. And, oh, man, look at that. I just realized my hunger is way, way down. We're going to have to eat ourselves two delicious and nutritious steakums. And we're going to we're gonna munch them on down. Oh, they're digesting in my belly button right now. Oh, goodness. They're tasting absolutely amazing as we're building right here. I really, I want to eat some more steak. I wish my hunger was down further. We got to do something to get this hunger down further. Because I got to eat some more steaks before this episode's up. I'm telling you what, those are some good steaks. So we're going to go ahead and place these all the way across like so and uh once we uh once we get down a little bit further we we, we should start from the bottom and, and work our way up we could we could do that instead of working from the top down because i feel like this might not be the best idea but it also you know what it might be the best idea i don't know whatever whatever floats your goat i don't know well, we're gonna go ahead and keep on going on down here we're gonna keep on there we go we're gonna keep on floating is what we're doing we're gonna keep on floating i'm trying to i'm trying to be very careful not to fall off the edge i'm kind of feeling like i should do the uh the outer perimeter first but you know what we're already getting so much done um, let's at least get this bottom part done first. Let's let's at least do this much. And we can kind of fill in the rest of that as it comes. So we're going to go ahead and do this. Also, we still have to do the entire back side of that thing. So we're going to need more wool. We're going to need more spruce. We're going to need more uh, full-on oak logs. We're going to need a lot more wood to actually get the back side of this done. This whole back empty panel right here. So we're going to need... Um, to match that with the front somehow. I mean, it's going to be a little bit different because we do have like a little opening in the front for our balcony. But we're going to go ahead and uh, finish this up. We're going to place these all the way across like this. I think I need at least one more. Oh my goodness, there's a mutton down there. Should we hop down to grab the mutton? Should we? Yeah, we're doing it. We're doing it. We need the mutton. Oh, no, we did it. We got two muttons. That's exactly, exactly what I was planning. I totally knew that was going to be two muttons. I don't know what you're talking about. So we're going to go ahead and grab these right here. And then what we're going to do is we're going to run all the way back on over here. And we're going to start getting this done. Actually, as a matter of fact, you know what we could do? We could kind of hold up. Let's see. Am I going to? All right. I got an idea. So we're going to go. I'm going to place some like this. Place some like that. Look. See, we're out. Oh, no, no. Bad idea. Carnage, bad idea. You should have stuck to doing it with the lines like what you were doing. What is this? Can we even reach down there? Can we even reach down there? I don't even think we can. I'm trying to get the very edge of the corner. Ugh. Nope, I'm too short. Someone done chop my knees off. I got I got shorter. I'm telling you, I could have reached that a long time ago. So we're going to go ahead and uh, continue placing these all the way across like so. We're going to get um, the majority of this done today. We got a good amount of planks here. We don't have all of the planks that we're going to need for this, I don't think. I think we're going to be a little bit short, but we should be quite close. So we're going to uh, we're gonna place these all the way across like so. Boom, there we go. We got that whole entire row done. All right, so here's basically what I was thinking before is that we would go kind of place like a few here, there's a few there, and kind of build it off this way, right? So we don't have to, we don't have to do it one row at a time, but this might, you know what? I think what I'm doing is actually better. Do like two rows at a time. Yeah, check this out. This is, this is some speedy roof building, I tell you what. So we're going to go out and place these across like this. Oh, goodness. But it's also, you got to be very careful because this kind of stuff happens. You done, you done derped it up, Carnage. We're going to go out and place these right here. We go and place these all the way across like so. Place these all the way across like so. And we should start crafting because we're going to fall off the edge here in a second if we don't. I'm going to go and place these right here. Place these right here. I think it's all lined up. It looks all lined up. I'm pretty sure. I'm like 100% confident at this point that it's all lined up. So we can go ahead. Oh, this one should be easy, right? We should just be able to run all the way back without having to worry about falling. Well, and now we can because we got it. We got a giant gap down there. We're going to, we're going to, oh my goodness. <laughs> I was looking in front of me not to fall and I fell off the backside. 
All right, guys, I can't believe that just happened. So we're gonna go ahead and run right back on over here. I can't believe it. I was looking at every other side except for the back side. I, I, I thought I had more time, man. I thought I had more time. So we're gonna go ahead and run right on over here. And we're gonna place some more. We're gonna place one here, one here, one here, one here, one here, one. Uh oh, we ran out. <laughs> Wait, did we even finish the side? Yeah, we did. Look at that. We got it in perfect timing. We do not have any more of the uh, of the spruce planks. But look at that. We are so close. You know what I'm thinking we should do? We should go actually chop down some more spruce. We got a giant spruce forest over here. So I think we could at least chop down a few more trees and get that part done, right? Right? That seems like it's doable. Let's actually go. Uh, let's do one more thing, though, before we do that. Let's actually go right on over to the front. I want to see, uh, again, I, I want to remember what I did on the front here. All right, so we had, all right, so basically we had spruce starting right here. We had spruce going one layer under all of these. So we also have to do that, that little uh, layer of spruce. So we, like that part right there, all these blocks that I'm looking at that go all the way up that arch up. We got to do that as well. So we do need a little bit more spruce and we also do need um, some oak wood so that we can do some type of pattern. I'm thinking we could have it kind of look like this one does, but we'll just kind of skip the little doorway right there. Maybe do something a little bit different. I don't know, but we're going to go ahead and run right on over here. We're going to get ourselves some more spruce and we're going to get this place built up. Also, one more thing I need to look at before we uh, do this is I need to see it needs to be uh, it needs to be indented by two. So basically the spruce um, those spruce pieces right there, they go, uh, they start two in. They don't start after the first block, they start after the second block. So we gotta keep that in mind, so that whenever we're on the inside and we're working on that, we can, we can do that. So, let's go ahead and run right on over here. We're gonna chop down at least, I would say, two more tall spruce trees. That should be enough. Maybe we should chop down three, but we're gonna go into the middle of the forest and we're gonna chop down, um, we're gonna chop down one that doesn't seem like it's in... In, uh, like out in the open by itself. We gotta find one in a cluster is what we gotta find. So we're gonna go like this one right here. You are a cluster tree. We're gonna get you on out of here, buddy. I'll save you from your cluster. Well, it gets you on out of here. We're gonna. Oh, we almost, we almost, I, I almost fell off the edge, right? We gotta be careful about edges, man. We're gonna, we've been falling off edges left and right today. So we're gonna go, not, actually, not left and right. We've fallen off edges backwards. So we're gonna go ahead and go and grab all these right here. And then we're going to grab, I would say, at least one more tall tree. You will do. You are a big, tall tree. You might be the tallest tree I ever encountered in my life, ever. Yep, we got to go up. I think we only need to go up by one block. If it's like the other tree. Let's see, is it just one block? Yeah, look at that. See, I didn't go too far this time. So we're going to go ahead, chop these down right here. And we're going to go work on this roof. It looks like it is going to turn nighttime here shortly. So we're going to try to be very, 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 very quick. And oh, yeah, look at this. We get to eat ourselves some more steak. All that hard work out here has then uh, given us the opportunity to eat ourselves some more steak. So we're going to go ahead and run right on down here. We're going to make as many planks as we can. We're going to grab all the planks that we can. We're going to have a little bit over a stack. we got a stack plus 20. That should be enough. At least I'm hoping it is. We're going to go ahead and run right on up to the top again. And once we get up here, we should be able to place these last little bit. We only got two more rows, right? That's it. So we're going to go ahead and get rid of this little torch right here. We're going to place these all the way across. And we got to start crouching earlier this time so we don't fall off the edge. The last thing we want to do is fall off the edge again. That would be crazy talk. So we're going to go ahead and uh, place these all the way across like so. And we literally got one more row and then we will be done. And then we can go to the Wall of Carnage. My absolute favorite thing in this entire series. Because it's where I get to add one of you guys to my world forever and ever and ever. So we're going to go ahead and place these blocks all the way across like so. Look at this. This is looking amazing. Our roof is coming together quite nicely. So we're going to place these all the way like so. Place them down. Look at that. We're also going to add this together so we don't have two different uh, stacks right there. But look at that. We've done it. We have finished our roof. I cannot believe it. We put in so much hard work. And just like that, it's done. Spider, you're not messing with me today. I'm, gonna, I'm running away from you. All right. So we're going to go ahead and go up here. Remember, we do have to go and uh, do the extra little inner row of, uh, of spruce. And then we also have to do like the extra... Um, like oak logs and all that. So we do have this whole entire side right here to do. This whole entire front side right here. Or back side. This whole entire back side right here we still have to do. But we will get that done shortly. Also, we could reuse all of this spruce wood um, on our last on our last climb up if we want to. So let's go ahead and go inside really quick. We're going to go to sleep. And then we are going to go to the Wall of Carnage. So we're going to go ahead and run right on over here. The mobs are spawning everywhere. So we got to be very, very careful. Bandit, I should have had you out there, buddy. There's a, there's a lot of skeletons out there. I know you would love to bite their faces off. But maybe we'll do that a different time so let's go ahead or i should say definitely we'll do that a different time because bandit loves biting some faces off so we're gonna go ahead and go to sleep really quick and when we wake up we're gonna go to the wall of carnage and we're gonna see who has been added today so down the stairs we go 
And we're gonna say bye, Bandit. We're gonna we're gonna talk to you in the next episode, but we're gonna go ahead and go right on out these back doors and look around for creepers, because sometimes creepers do creep on the wall of carnage. And then we're gonna see who has been added today. Joining us today on the wall of carnage is Gaming Legends. So congratulations, Gaming Legends, on getting added to the Wall of Carnage. Now remember, guys, if you want to get added to the Wall of Carnage, just like Gaming Legends over here, all you gotta do is leave some comments down in the comment section below, and I'll be choosing one lucky person each and every episode to add to the Wall of Carnage. But with that said, I hope you guys did enjoy this video, and if you did, you know what to do. Go ahead and leave a like on this video, and if you are one of the first 100 people to like this video, let me know down in the comments section below but i've been carnage the creator catch you guys in the next video and i'm out carnage the creator yeah 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 you're watching carnage the creator yeah 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 you're watching carnage the creator yeah 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 you're watching carnage the creator 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 yeah, yeah.